Germs, welcome, welcome, welcome to Dilettante Ball. I'm Johnny. I'm Spencer. Here on Dilettante Ball, we go on Wikipedia. We learn about the states. And we talk about the states. Yeah, yeah we do. Uh, we're back in our home base. Yeah, it feels good. feels good. It feels yeah. very good. This is the first, well, this weekend coming up will be the first weekend in three weekends that I've been home. Well, yeah, it's true. Yeah. Um, it was Michigan, then Kansas City, and, and then, then I was in sunny Florida. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Attending... The opening night of Halloween Horror Nights, the nation's premier Halloween event. <laughs> Jack's uh, back, baby. <laughs> Jack's back. You know this to be true. <laughs> and it was a fucking blast. That yeah, was a fright fest. Oh my god, it was great. All right, good. I'll tell you. I tell me uh, what was your like. What was the best? Best. Thing? But well, there were two haunted houses that stood out okay. to me. One was the I forget what it was called, but it was like the because this was the 25th year. Okay. So it was like a a 25th anniversary haunted house. So it was just. Stuff from oh from it's like from a, like a, a, every all, year everything. yeah the t- the twenty five scariest things yeah. all in one house it was great and then the other one was Alice in Wonderland three uh, D and that was scary or no the best that was just one, it was of, the one of the best it was, okay. I mean, it was scary too sure 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 um yeah it was great you put on three D glasses and everything on the walls is like painted crazy so okay. shit pops out and you can't tell can't like tell how far stuff is sure. it's great huh that's interesting uh, it, I don't think it was actually oh it was called Asylum in Wonderland okay that's funny that's a good yeah. plan words. Um, yeah, it was great. There was also an insidious haunted house, and I uh, yeah, I know you were uh, you were sort of giving a play by play to uh, to our friend Brad Pike, who is a uh, oh man, insi- he loves insidious. Yeah, I I actually he for some t- s- demonic twist of fate, as I was walking into the house, Brad Pike called me. No way, and he never calls me. Yeah, you yeah know, like who, does. who calls anyone? He called me, and I was like, Brad, I can't talk to you. I'm going into the insidious house. <laughs> Uh, and then he just orgasmed. He just killed himself. Yeah, right. Yeah. It's the same thing for him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were like at a party and he was like he was like you were giving him the play by play and then he was giving me the play by play. So it was man. like yeah, a whole string of like people just yeah, yeah. Living vicariously. It was great. I sent him a picture. Yeah. Um I was it was great. It was great. That's good. I'm glad, I've um, never even seen the movie. I haven't either. I, I really want to. I heard the the plot and it sounded so much more interesting than I thought it was. Yeah. I, I don't know for some reason I, I was like, nah, I'm, I don't like that movie. I thought it was like a uh like a paranormal activity or mm. something like something I was like, ah, who cares? But yeah, sounds 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 good. Uh, afterwards, I hung out with my friend Andrew, friend of the show, Andrew Kid, yeah, and one of his friends who's a character. Ooh. So I got some inside scoops. Wow, it's pretty cool. Can you talk about them? I mean, nothing crazy. Okay, just then. like apparently, I'll like, gi- I'll give you this. Okay, we rub you later on our entire body so we don't sweat. Like, uh, if you if like the management doesn't like you. Uh-oh. Or you like fuck up or whatever. They put you in the Walking Dead house. Why? I don't know. <laughs> that's just like that's just like the shitty house, I okay, guess, sure. where they send people they don't like. All right. So, that's so if you're in the Walking Dead house, they don't like you. Yeah, I hate to break it to you. That's really interesting. I like that. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um, that's all. Good deal. Yeah. Last week we had Colorado, mm-hmm. Wyoming, and last week feels like it was so long ago. I mean, I guess it was technically, but no longer than it usually is between episodes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, you've been, you've been. I've been jet setting. Uh, yeah, wheeling and dealing. I've been jet set radio featuring. Mm-hmm. You think Wyoming? Yeah, just because it's right there. I think Oregon. Good nope, choice. Nope, we already did Oregon. Did what we? was the one? Oklahoma. That's the one that oh, I actually yeah. think it is. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, you ready? I'm ready. Hmm. North Dakota. Wait. Whoa. What? Hold on. Oh no. How do we want to do this? What? North Dakota and South Dakota entered on the same day. Whoa. <laughs> oh, buddy. What do we do? Do we do a do we do a two parter? Or do we do, do, yeah, we we'll do, do we'll do this one, we'll do a cliffhanger. Oh <laughs> Okay. So no, t- we'll this do, is North Dakota. Right, because it's alphabetically first. Yes. Yes, correct. And, and closer to God. N- um Santa? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Same thing. November 2nd, 1989. Whoa, 13 years after Colorado. Whoa, that's bizarre. We're like running out of years. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we're going to be able to get them all in before I, 2015. Yeah, we're running out of yeah, we're running out of runway real quick. <laughs> I mean, yeah, if we're, if we're taking 13, 13 years, years in between. Yeah, you do the math. Is my math is my math incorrect? 1876 to 1889. No, that's 13 years, yeah, right? Boom. Yeah, you did it. Isn't that weird that Colorado was just kind of hanging out in space? Yeah. Like what happened there? Who knows? And why do they choose that arbitrary border? That's weird. That North Dakota and South it's, Dakota weren't just yeah. It's one like perfectly state. square. Like every other border is like oh, those are rivers and things. Yeah. It's like there's there's no way there's four rivers. That's insane, right? Before that, it was the Dakota Territory. Sure. 
Let's get right in. Do it. Uh, their flag says North Dakota. It's got a crazy looking eagle the with e- a shield body. The eagle looks like a goose. Yeah, it's not a great eagle. <laughs> um, it's e- pretty bad. E pluribus unum. It looks like a ninth grader drew this in 1885. Yeah. <laughs> he won the contest. Yeah. Their seal. Not. Liberty worse, and actually. Union now and forever one and inseparable. Oh, man. North Dakota is the king of run-on sentences. That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> Liberty and Union now and forever one and inseparable. That <laughs> sucks. That's really bad. And there's a tree and a plow and a I think an Indian it, riding a horse. It looks like the front yard of a redneck. There's just shit scattered everywhere in the front yard. Also, it says October 1st, 1889, but... It was admitted to the Union November 2nd, 1889. Who even knows? October 1st is when we stole it from the Indians. <sighs> Nicknames. Peace Garden State. Mm. Rough Rider State. Okay. All right. Flicker Tail State. That's interesting. It's probably a butterfly. That's my oh, guess. Oh, yeah. Mottos. Liberty and Union, now and forever, one and inseparable. Okay. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Official language English. Demonym North Dakotan. Okay. I hope that South Dakota's demonym is South Dakotian. Yeah, it's, like it's yeah. different. Yeah, like, for no, some we're reason. different. Capital? Oh, uh, uh, Pierre Montpellier. <laughs> Tim- oh, Timpani. Nope. Oh, uh, freestyle rap. Bismarck. <laughs> nice. Bismarck. Nice. Yeah, that's a good. That's a good. It was a good hint. You're right. Yeah. You're I right know. to do that. I know. Largest city. Oh, oh, I mean, it's gotta be the same, right? Bismarck. Fargo. Oh, oh don't you know? Largest metro, Fargo Metropolitan Area. Area ranked 19th. Hmm. Pretty big, pretty big. Population, 47th. Oh, oh, wow. That's crazy. There's like eight people that live there. Whoa, damn. Holy crap. <laughs> 739,482 people. There's That's so few people. There are like more, more people, people in, in this, this apartment. building. Yeah. yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> that's nobody. Yeah, that's nobody. That's like bonkers. Yeah, that's like a, a, how many people? Yeah, if it, that's like seven football stadiums worth of people. That's like nobody. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> that's totally it. God, like who cares? Kick them out. We're done here. Ugh. Although when Sturgis happens, I bet it's it gets oh crazy. damn, dude. Pro- it becomes like the second highest population in this in the in the country. <laughs> so many bikers. Um, elevation highest point White Butte. Lowest Red River of the North at Manitoba border. Before statehood, Dakota Territory. Admission to the Union, November second, eighteen eighty nine. Ab- uh, abbreviation ND. Sure. Website ND.gov. Sure. I ain't mad at that. Um, if it ain't broke. Oh, most of the state is in Central Time Zone, but the southwest portion of the state is in Mountain Time. That's curious. Yeah. I wonder why that is. I don't know. I guess we'll never know. Unlucky. Florida's like that too. Part of the panhandle is in Central Time, I believe. That's true. It is. That's exactly right. Stupid. It's that's stupid. Well, no, that makes sense because it's like st- it's stretching to the west. Yeah, but so, why, you, so here's what what doesn't make sense to me is why isn't just all of Western North Dakota in the time zone? How come it's just a tiny little corner? I think that it should be all of. It makes no sense for all of. W- one state to not be they should redraw the, the, well, the time zone border we should there should be a quadruple the number of time zones so they oh and I, i'm an eight now it's eight fifteen. now it's eight thirty. now it's eight forty five. like that'd be insane it'd be more accurate though but at what cost uh sanity <laughs> <laughs> um we don't yeah, get you like lose or gain like half an hour just driving to work that <laughs> <laughs> you're late well well <laughs> not by my watch <laughs> north dakota Pronunciation. North Dakota. <laughs> I want to hear this because it's going to be read by an idiot. El Norteño. North Dakota. Do it. North Dakota. Oh, that sounds crazy. <laughs> uh, is the 39th state in the United States having been admitted to the Union on November 2nd, 1889. It's located in the upper Midwestern region of the United States, bordered by the Canadian provinces of Saskatchewan and Manitoba to the north, and the states of Minnesota to the east, South Dakota to the south, and Montana to the west. State capital is Bismarcky, and the largest city is Fargo. North Dakota is the 19th most extensive, but fourth least populous and fourth least densely populated of the 50 states. North Dakota has weathered the Great Recession of the early 21st century with a boom in natural resources. Really? Particularly a boom in oil extraction from the Bacon Formation. B-A-K-K-E-N? 
back in back. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I was ready to make it like a snide joke. Like, yeah, of course they weathered the recession because there was no one there to weather it. But well, if they had an oil boom, and everybody, I don't know. Yeah, all eight people are fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. Uh, we got oil. <laughs> Uh, which lies beneath the northwestern part of the state. The development has driven strong job and population growth and low unemployment. When you've only got to employ 700,000 people, <laughs> how hard is it? Yeah. Also, they're, my guess is they're fracking. Fracking what? Uh, <laughs> you think so? You, th- you think so? Probably. And our stance on hydraulic fracturing is... A- anti. Okay, good. Yeah. Me too. I don't, uh, hey, some, somebody, somebody poisoned the water hole. That's what happens, right? They poison the water hole mm-hmm. with g- gas. Olean. Uh-huh. Uh huh. <laughs> uh. Yeah, it's <rompe. laughs> Uh That's it for the beginning. So that's curious. Not much. North uh, Dakota's to just as boring as you would yeah. imagine. Uh, yeah, flat and unimaginative. Unimag- um, just a shitty place, I guess. Yeah, and that's why only seven hundred thousand people live there. That's gotta be kind of interesting. Do you think everybody knows everybody? That's. I mean, you know, kind of. Like, I bet you could recognize her. You're like, oh, I don't know him, but I recognize him. I've seen him on the bus. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, I, uh, most of the state can't be inhabited. No, no, know? I doubt it. Um, Everybody lives in Fargo. Right, exactly, though. Like, and man, then there's what like, if there was just one city, or like, you know, there's, so everyone lives in Fargo, but they just arbitrarily chose another place for the capital city and erected like uh, flats, basically. So it's a ghost. It's like a ghost town, like like. Um, like a stage, uh, yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. a staged town. Like the like the city in North Korea that's on the border with South Korea. They uh, have like a fake city there. Sure, yeah, so yeah that right. When people look across the border, it's like, oh, look, it's a bustling city. Right, but behind it, there's just mounds it's of just garbage. Facades, and, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. All I know about North Dakota is that it's uh, it, it has Sturgis, the bike rally. Um, and I know that uh, the only thing South, De- well, let's let's leave off South Dakota for the cliffhanger. Yeah, I know everyone's gonna get really excited about that. <laughs> Our first two-parter. <laughs> That's that'll be fun. Yeah, yeah, in a stupid way. Oh, here, here we go. State symbols. Oh, the best. These are the best parts. Yeah, state bird, western meadowlark. Boring. State fish, northern pike. Okay. Uh, and it has the the like a picture. No, the scientific oh. names. Oh, that's that's oh that's very interesting. Um, st- I'm not gonna say him. State horse, Nakota horse. Interesting, they have a state horse. State hippo. St- yeah, African hippo. The state horse is the horse, <laughs> of course. State flower, wild prairie rose. Hmm. State tree, <laughs> American elm. State fossil, Teredo, petrified wood. State grass. That, how boring is that? Yeah. Our our favorite fossil is wood. <laughs> you suck. State grass, western wheatgrass. Uh, bu- boy, bu- boy, state motto or state nicknames: Rough Rider State, Flickertail State, Peace Garden State, Sioux State. They, they, okay, S I O U X. Choose a choose an Indian. Okay, Sioux or Dakota. You don't get both. <laughs> also, you don't get to name yourself cool. That the, North Dakota is the kid that chose his own nickname in high school. But yeah, I'm, I'm Flickertail. No, you're fucking not, dude. Like, you suck. Yeah, you're <laughs> you're petrified wood. <laughs> petrified wood. Sweet pecker. <laughs> Great uh, state mottos. Liberty and Union, now and forever, one and inseparable. That's my favorite thing I've ever heard. Yeah, this, yeah, this, this kid is just padding his essay. He's not. He, but on the coat of arms of North Dakota, it says "Strength from the soil." <laughs> All right. Okay. Sure. Oh, the Latin motto of North Dakota, effective August first, first two thousand eleven. You can't just make up a new motto. No, no, guys, guys, I, fi- I figured it out. Led Zeppelin rules. Serit ut altiri seclo prosit. Okay. One sows for the benefit of another age. S O W S. Okay, so like, 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 like. It sucks p- now. Right. But we're just we're <laughs> everything that we're doing now that's shitty is to make it better later. Right. Right. How long have they been telling themselves that? Since August first, two thousand eleven. <laughs> State slogan. No, my God. What's? Well, they got more. This is like. Yes, the kid who makes up his own nickname. <laughs> okay. This would be his fucking slogan. Awesome. Ride the lightning. Better. Uh, 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 it's uh, one. It's one word. I'll give you. It's one word. Prestidigitation. Legendary. <laughs> <laughs> you suck. State song. North Dakota hymn. State dance. Square dance. Ugh. State fruit. Choke cherry. Choke cherry. State march. Flicker tail march. No. State beverage. Milk. Of course it is. State Art Museum. Ugh. 
the Chicago North, Metropolitan. North Dakota Museum of Art. Yeah, there's like four things there. State license plate. What? Square, rectangle. See the different plates over time. <laughs> That's that. Like, I, I mean, then there's like a footnote. Uh huh. So I guess that's just a link to another website that I'm not gonna bother. No, with. of course not. The Flickertail State is one of North Dakota's nicknames and is derived from Richardson's ground squirrel, a very common animal in the region. The ground squirrel cons- constantly flicks its tail in a distinctive manner. In 1953, legisl- legislation to make the ground squirrel the state emblem was voted down in the state legislature. Uh, too interesting. <laughs> What's next on the docket? Uh, we all um. We uh, we want our beverage to be uh, uh, honey. No, no, honey's not a beverage. Uh, how about milk? All right, all right, cool. Uh, next on the docket, we uh, uh, f- a favorite fossil. We were thinking f- uh, Fred Flintstone. Nope, that's a cartoon. How about the ribs that Fred Flintstone eats? Nope, that's ribs. <laughs> but yeah, from Brontosaurus though. Uh, let's just go with petrified wood. Okay. <laughs> this guy sucks. And you know some asshole yeah. who's like state slogan. Legend. No, wait for wait it. Wait for it. Fucking dickheads. Yeah, I know. Fucking worst thing of all time. Well, fuck off. It sucks that we're going to be 85 and people are going to be saying that. They're going to be saying, like, Bazinga. Oh, my God. Like, on the like, Senate floor. Like, mm, that's going to be real, yeah. though. Yeah. That Bazinga. sucks. Bazinga. And, and the whole floor. Ho, 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 ho. Ho, ho, ho. What's. <laughs> oh, the. That's the Senate floor. That's them, like, I don't know. That's how like, senators laugh. Ho, 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 Polite, <laughs> polite yet jovial. Oh, here's a thing uh, that I don't want to talk about. Cool. Apparently today, I'll talk about I, it. I, I, I'll, I'll tell you how I got there. This was real A to C. If you're an improviser, uh, asshole. So, so uh, <laughs> sen- senators reminded me of the Galactic Senate naturally, and I thought of uh, Padme when she says, "This is how liberty dies." To thunderous applause. Sure. And then I thought about the new Star Wars thing that was released today that someone told me about. The 360 degree. Yeah, thing. that's all I know. That's all I know too. I haven't seen it. Sounds pretty awesome. So you could just like basically mm-hmm. take a 360 degree tour of this area or something. Apparently, right? it's a video. Okay. So you so can as move you're like the on- camera around while the video is playing. Sure. So, you so it's have like to on watch rails, it. but you can kind of move your head. You have to watch the video 360 times to catch every degree. <laughs> sure. Sure. Uh, yeah, I didn't watch either. Out of solidarity. So I can't wait. Are you are you gonna stop now? No, I mean I've been pretty good about like like basically I was like okay I'm gonna watch the trailers. I'm not gonna seek out any other information though. Like I I mean like I was saying I saw a, 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 a article about someone talking about the toys and they already had all their names and I was like how do you know that I don't want to know that. My friend said this thing to me which is crazy. When I go to see the movie, mm. there are gonna be people dressed up as new characters. What the fuck do I do? Um, I mean, I feel like then I kind of just have to be like, all right. Just look down at your feet the whole time. Like, don't do anything. When we were in Florida, yeah, we went into a mall, which is awesome. crazy because I haven't been in one in forever. Sure. I couldn't go in any stores. Oh, wow. We were, we were like, we, we came in through a Barnes & Noble. We're walking through and Jessica says, put your head down. Put your head down. <laughs> so there's like just a huge display in the middle sure. of Star Wars. I wanted to go in Spencer Gifts. Of course you Naturally. Did. Duh. Couldn't. Because you missed me. First, walk in. She said, nope, can't. We can't. can't. Turn around. Turn around. We were in a grocery store, yeah. a Publix. She said, don't. Don't, don't look at the soda. She, she said, don't look behind you. That coffee creamer has Star Wars on it. <laughs> that coffee creamer. What the fuck is my life right now? Panda Express was giving out, like, samples of Star Wars chicken. Star- <laughs> it's our new. You know they have chicken? Great. <laughs> Poodoo. Uh, that's that is funny though. In one of the books, yeah, it, 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 Luke is like eating noodles, right. and that makes sense to have noodles, right? But then the noodles have garlic in them, right? Right. Well, and it's just called garlic, and it's and after they had already been talking about like, oh, it's bantha sauce, yeah, like, all this like, like stupid bantha like, sauce like, and space soy, uh, rancor nuggets, right? And, right. But and garlic, garlic. Yeah. like <laughs> wait a minute, we garlic. can't make up a fake fucking <laughs> like spicy thing to put in here, right? Right. L- <laughs> and you anything you uh, could literally yeah, say yeah. any word Gar- garlicsian could have it could have even been almost the same or maybe garlic is not actually garlic but it's a type of fish <laughs> and maybe we're just the idiots or maybe garlic on maybe we have garlic but it's from star wars like Ooh. it's yeah right exactly just like we still have people but there are people in star wars it's kind of like that <laughs> You ever think about that? No. No. Okay. What's What's your opinion on J.K. Rowling? Um, Mine is. She needs to shut up if she's not writing books. Yeah. She can't. She can't just sit from her armchair and like lob lob in like, oh yeah, no, no, no. By the way, this thing. 
Oh yeah, and also this. Like, I feel like she's like tweeting at people, like, yeah, well, you know, that's not really what I intended. And it's like, well, if you didn't intend it, then write a fucking book. It's like, cra- it's like weird stuff too. Like, oh yeah, well, um, <laughs> yeah, Harry, Harry was circumcised, and the reason, yeah, yeah, it's like, like okay, weird. It doesn't matter. Right. I love Harry Potter more than anything, sure. but lady, cool, cool it, yeah. Like, oh yeah, you know, Voldemort is actually pronounced Voldemort. It's like. Okay. Should have told us that, yeah, 10, 10. 15 years ago. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yeah, she got such a hankering to stay in the world and be relevant or whatever. Then it's like, well, then do it. Write, write me a book. Write me a book. Oh yeah, pretend we, I'm a dying kid. Write me a book. We went to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Natch. Yeah, spooky, right? It was great. It was my favorite thing in the world. So if you ever have a chance to go, go. If you ever don't, don't. Um, you want to talk about South Dakota real quick? South Dakota. Yeah. Are we going <gasps> to... Cliffhanger! Smell you later. <laughs> North Dakota has we- weathered the Great Recession of the earliest... Uh, North Dakota has we... <laughs> Jesus. Right, take three. We'll get this in post. North... I will for real. <laughs> uh, I ain't going to sound like no fool. North Dakota has... Meanwhile, I'm over here. <laughs> oh, it's the capital's mind. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, buddy. North Dakota has This is your passive aggressive way. <laughs> this is your passive aggressive way of getting back at me for, for not doing any actual work on this podcast. <laughs> and and this is my passive aggressive way of forcing you to keep all this in. I just no, it'll I'll put it all at the end. <laughs> okay. I I uh <laughs> I add myself making stupid noises and then <laughs> add it into your words that you say. <laughs> Alright, try it again. This has been a Peaches and Hot Sauce presentation. Peaches. Hot Sauce. 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 Peaches. Hot sauce.